trying for this uh, D3 title for a couple years now. You had a great team last year. This, this year, what was different? I think, the, uh, I think the confidence level was a little bit different this year. Last year, we, were, uh, we just seemed happy to be here a little bit. And we, were, um, we weren't really, we didn't have the same sort of expectations. This year, coming into the year, we had Clark Tournament Championship, District Championship, and eventually, hopefully, the state championship on our mind. And we just knew that if we played our game, nobody could really beat us. Yeah, can you talk about, uh, you know, not, not just this title, you guys also won the Clark. It's a lot of games, you know, that's a, that's a tough road to do both. Um, what, is, what does that mean to you guys, having, having won both of those now? I mean, it's a great feeling. We go into every year looking forward to those two things, the Clark and the districts. So, obviously, to get, that, to get those two things done, it feels great. We're just looking forward to the next game. Yeah, Chris. It was, um, it's not, the, the number of games, it's, uh, it's not really any different than the year. We, uh, we had a good, they, 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 don't, they spread the games out plenty, so we're not really tired or anything. So we're just setting up practice, so we, uh, we didn't, that didn't really stop anything. You'd rather be playing games every other night, and uh, I think we enjoy that a lot more than going against each other every day. Yeah, I think this is uh, 20 straight wins for you guys. Um, can you just talk about, you know, uh, the, the type of team that you guys have where you're just, you know, together, Every game, never let down. You know, contributions from all around, and and what's what's gone right for you guys during that run? Well, uh, I don't think we we don't really talk about it. We we actually, that's one thing that's been it's kind of weird. We've never talked about wins. It's always been on to the next game. It's a point we lost that one game. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. But now that we look back on it, but uh, <laughs> so we don't really talk about it though. We haven't talked about winning streaks or anything like that. We're just. We're looking forward to the next game, and I think that's, uh, that's what's really helped us. Yeah, I think it's the team chemistry we have. We know any game we come into, even if one or two guys are having an off night, we have guys who can come off the bench. The rest of the starters, um, we can pick up the slack for them. Yeah. Um, Chris, can you talk? I think, um, I think you were scoreless in the first quarter, or, or had a, a sort of a quiet first quarter. Um, ended up finishing with 26. Uh, can you uh, explain after that? Was it just, you know? It was. Uh, the whole game, we moved the ball, we trusted each other, and I knew that at some point I might get going, at some point I might not, but I knew that we were going to be able to keep scoring the ball if we trusted each other. <laughs> and luckily, these guys, my teammates, found me in great spots, and I was able to knock down some shots, and I got, I got to the foul line a lot down the stretch, and I was able to hit them. But we just, the thing about us is as long as we're trusting each other, anybody can get going at any time, and I think that, uh, I think that really helps us. Yeah. Uh can you guys talk about the, the style, of, style of play you guys use? Um, you know, it seems so cohesive, always a step ahead out on the break, and, and uh, really a, a ton of weapons, a bunch of different guys you can score. Yeah, we, we love to run, get on the fast break. Obviously, uh, a lot of us have been playing together since we were in first grade, so we know a lot of the time on the fast break where each other's going to be. Chris will have the ball in his hands, he'll find us. Um, so yeah, I think we have great team chemistry since we've been playing together for so long. Yeah. Everybody just runs the floor hard, and if I'm able to get it up, we have a lot of guys, Danny and Travis and Sully and Anthony, that everybody knows how to finish and transition. And if I get it up to them, I know they're going to make plays and we're going to get buckets. Yep. Uh, you mentioned last year at this point, sort of, sort of just happy to be at this, uh, at, at this level. Um, what's What's sort of the mindset going into you know the next step, the state semifinals coming up? It's it's we think we can beat anybody at this point. We're uh, we're not going to go in nervous or have any have any jitters in the, at the next step. But I think we're just we're playing confident. We know that if we play as a team, we play together. Anybody we can beat anybody, and it's going to be a good game. And I just think that that really benefits us at this point. Mm -hmm.